amazing migrations, butterflies, bats and birds, by Cheryl Willis Hudson. Some animals live in the same place all year long. Others move to new homes when the seasons change. These animals travel from one habitat to another. This movement is called migration. Three animals that migrate. Monarch butterflies, Mexican free-tailed bats and arctic terns all migrate. They don't look like each other, but they all fly. They live in different habitats. They travel over long distances. All three animals migrate when the seasons change. Salmon Sandhill crane Caribou Monarch butterfly Mexican free-tailed bat Arctic tern Migrating insects Monarch butterflies Monarch butterflies have orange, black and white wings. During the summer, these insects live in the north. In the fall, the weather becomes cold. They fly south to a warmer climate. In the spring, the butterflies return north. The butterflies that fly south are not the same ones that return in spring. The reason is the butterfly's lifespan. A lifespan is how long an animal lives. Most monarchs live only a few weeks. They have a short lifespan. The Super Generations Journey Each year one generation of monarchs lives longer than the others. A generation is all of the butterflies born at one time. This generation of butterflies lives eight or nine months. In the fall, this super generation migrates. It makes the full journey south. Many generations fly north. In the spring, the super generation starts the journey north. It does not get far. The butterflies stop in the southern United States. They lay eggs and die. A new generation is born. These butterflies continue the journey. They go a little farther, lay eggs and die. This next generation continues the journey. It takes three or four generations to reach their northern home. Migrating Mammals Mexican Free-Tailed Bats Many Mexican free-tailed bats live in Texas. These bats are flying mammals. Mammals are warm-blooded animals. They are usually covered in fur. Most mammals can't fly, but Mexican free-tailed bats can. These mammals also migrate. Mexican free-tailed bats live in huge colonies. Many colonies are in caves. Sometimes millions of bats live in one cave. At night they fly out of their homes. They search for food. They eat moths and other insects. Like monarch butterflies, many free-tailed bats fly south for the winter. Their journey starts in the fall. It isn't quite as long as the monarch's trip. Free-tailed bats travel hundreds of miles. They arrive in Mexico. They stay there for the winter. In the spring, they fly north again. Migrating Birds Arctic Terns Arctic terns migrate the longest distance of all animals. They fly more than 35,000 miles round trip. These terns actually stay in the air for most of their lives. During the summer, they live far up north. Some live near the North Pole or Greenland. Then Arctic terns migrate to the other end of the world. They fly as far south as Antarctica. This journey is unlike the journey of the bats and the monarchs. Most of the terns' journey is over water. The terns fly thousands of miles over the ocean. The birds arrive on the ice packs of Antarctica. When the season changes again, the terns head back north. This time, they follow a different route. Moving with the seasons. Bats, terns and monarchs know when it's time to migrate. They sense changes in temperature and daylight. 
They use the position of the sun and stars to find their way. These special skills keep all three animals moving with the seasons. Glossary Climate The type of weather in one place. Generation A group of the same animal that is born at the same time. Insect An animal with six legs and three main parts to its body. Lifespan The time from an animal's birth until its death. Mammal, a warm-blooded animal, often covered with fur, that feeds its young with its milk. Migration, the movement of animals from one habitat to another.